Hey guys, um, what can I say? Uh, 3D printer is up and running. Um, not currently because you'd, you'd hear it, but the 3D printer is up and running and has been doing its job as you can clearly see. Um, now, I want to stress that 3D printing isn't for everyone. I have a slew of failed prints right here, okay? Some are missing legs, some are missing arms. I mean, this poor chaplain, he looks like he's amazing, yeah? But he's missing an entire leg. Yet I print, reprinted him and I got the leg back. Um, so long story short, learn from your mistakes. Keep a hold of your mistakes and learn from them. Um, I cannot stress that. Learn from your mistakes, guys. Um, the only thing I could take away from the failed leg on this guy was the fact that I didn't have the proper supports in it. And I had it angled at the wrong um, 45 degree vector. Uh, some models, um, depending on where you get them from, are going to have you know, all the support in the world for you. For example, this um, Death Corp Supreme uh, Burst which was technically my very first print ever on that th that printer over there, technically would be considered a failed print, even though everything printed just fine. What would it, what would it be considered as a failed print? Is the base. The base didn't print 100% flat. And that was because my bed wasn't correct in, in its angling. And so I learned from my mistakes you should always learn from your mistakes. Plus, I didn't hollow this guy out. This is solid, solid, solid resin. He weighs a ton compared to like a space marine. Okay, he weighs good, a good portion. And so, I'm going to be keeping this burst. I'm going to be painting it up on on live on Twitch, twitch.tv slash deceptive covers. And what I'm going to do at the end of the painting session, at the end, at the end of it, well, during the painting session of it, I'm going to raffle this guy off. Now, what I mean by that is people who donate $5 or more or give me 500 bits or more will be entered into a raffle for a chance to win this. Okay. And all the money that I get, um, I will donate a portion of it to charity and the rest I will use to help start up Nevermore Models, which is my 3D printing company. It's kind of like a mini Kickstarter, so you guys actually get something in return. But at the same time, I'm also going to be demonstrating what you can do with a 3D printer and what you can't. I.e., I'm going to show you my fails. We'll be doing some live printing. Granted, the prints take anywhere between two to six hours, depending on the size of what you're printing. But we will be printing some miniatures. Okay, I have some intercessor, well, I, I used to call them devastators because I'm an old school space marine player, but we've got some intercessors with heavy bolters. You know, I've got two of these guys, you know, we'll be painting these up um, in, the, in, the, the, in the stream. Uh, we've got a chaplain, as you just saw, but I'm also in the middle process of converting a 3D printed miniature by because I 3D printed extra parts, like some lightning claws. They're failed lightning claws, but I can easily re-sculpt blades onto them. But the majority of the weapon is still usable. Um, there you go, there's another Vanguard captain. You know, um, these miniatures are going to, again, I'm going to be painting them all up. Live on Twitch. I've even got two librarians. See? One with a beard, one without. I've got two librarians as well. Uh, we're also going to be doing some, some bases. Uh, so you guys get to see some custom bases like this one and this one uh, the custom bases like you go this is another custom base um, we're gonna do some custom bases this custom base is earmarked for the librarian uh, sorry for the chaplain um, so look forward to seeing that it's gonna be cool um, so yeah guys it's just it, it, it's I am genuinely having fun 3d printing um, I'm also going to explain what I'm going to be doing later on um, for Nevermore models, how I'm going to expand, how I'm going to grow, 
uh, what it takes to expand, what it takes to grow. Um, I'm also going to expand on uh, model companies, uh, uh, model makers that have what's known as an open patent, which means you can purchase the models from them for a flat fee and then print the models at, at your own cost. So I can sell them, I can basically resell them on legally without it being any kind of red tape and things of that nature. For example, there's a guy who, who does, it's called the Dark Gods. That's what he's got, along with another two model builders. I'm in the process of talking talk to this, the 3D sculptures, etc. I will be buying the STL files from them. So I will be taking money out of my own pocket. They will be paid for their work. But when it's done, I will legally own the model. So I can print it. I can not print it. I can do whatever the hell I want with it. So look forward to seeing those updates, guys, coming up on the Twitch channel. Again, it's twitch.tv slash receptive carabers. I hope to see you there. Um, it is 3.42 now. I will be going live at 6 p.m. UK time. Okay, so that's 6 p.m. UK time. So look forward to seeing you then, guys. Take care and model on, my friends.